In our last episode, Bucky O'Hare has made a horrifying discovery. Warren never looks like this. His own homeworld, Warren, has been conquered by the toads and turned into a giant swamp. And sure, it smells bad. He warns the United Animal Security Council. This is truly terrifying. The toads have perfected a planetary climate converter. And Genus is the next target of the toad invasion force. The Council finally agrees to add a second ship to the space fleet. Its commander, Dogstar. In his own universe, Willie challenges Doug McKenna and his bullies. We're going to do the big science project together. It's a computerized skateboard that analyzes every move you make. Okay, we'll build it. But if I don't pass, you're gonna be dog food. And as a backup to Willie, Bucky hires Al Negator to be his new warp drive engineer. Allow me to present my credentials. But Al is a spy for the Toads. He steals their defensive security codes. All right, computer. Download all security and clearance codes. Bruiser, we've got to get through that door. He's gone. Bucky follows Al Negator to a Toad mothership. We can't let him get away with those codes, no matter what the cost. <laughs> I've got you now, Bucky O'Hare. I, I've got him! I've got Bucky O'Hare! <laughs> Seal the bay doors! This is Andy Fibian reporting live for TTN, the Toad Network. That dangerous archfiend Bucky O'Hare and his band of mammalian menaces are at this moment being captured by one of our valiant motherships. Toadborn, sir, the toads in our audience would like to know. Ah, I have no time for such trivia. All right, if we split up, we've still got a chance to get those coats back before Al Negator delivers them to the toads. But, but by now, wouldn't he have handed them over? Al's a sleazosaur. Money means everything to his ilk. He won't give him those coats till he gets paid. That buys us some time. But we'll need a diversion. <laughs> Leave that to old dead eye! Sharp lads. If they won't come out, we'll have to drag them out. Get back! It's gonna explode! Follow me, Willie! Get your filthy mammal trick! Get them! Hold tight, matey! Jenny, be careful, Bucky! Seize the ship! Ayuka! A beetle Jovian map! Now do it! Fun! <laughs> yep, fun! <laughs> Commander Dogstar to Bucky O'Hare! Bucky, do you read me? Nothing, sir. Mmm, I feel it in my bones, Wolf. Bucky is in deep trouble. That's it! I knew I'd remember! That Sleezosaur Bucky Hard is the same lizard I smelled in Tinker's Spy Shop! Bad sign, sir. Set course for Bucky's last known position, and hurry! These guys are getting me steamed! <laughs> It's not nice to stare. What's that? A void droid! My blasters can't hurt it! It's gonna get us! Willie, really, use your secret human weapon! But did I? It's only a... Lay the gap and shoot! Don't believe it! It was ray-shielded and missile-shielded! But not waterproof! Willie, 
There's something been nagging at my conscience. What is it, did I? This is your money that I took from your kit. Haha, <laughs> that's okay, did I? It's only play money. <laughs> from the looks of it, you play for big stakes, bucko. <laughs> Where, where are you, Maddie? Brother. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, my, my. What in the anniversary are you? Have no fear, Bucky O'Hare is. Your people are gone. Gone to slave in our factories for the glory of the Supreme Toad race. You will never see them again. Yeah? Choke on this, robot! I am no mere robot. I am Toad War. Soon you're gonna be smorgasbord! Set it as high as you want. You cannot stop me. Sweet dreams, Bucky O'Hare. Bucky! He is my prisoner, and you are next. Honestly, you robots are getting so cheeky. Metal shell is the remains of a living toad soldier. How fascinating that you perceive this. We must discuss it some other time. Put them in the jettison tubes. They will talk or be destroyed. Dress like a baboon, but. Pink skin, how curious. And you're the one who stole the defense codes. Give them back or I'll, I'll stomp you. Nothing but simoleons will pry these codes from me. Is that all you want? Lousy old simoleons? Huh? What could be more valuable than simoleons? This, genuine uh, uh, willies. One of these is worth a uh, hundred simoleons. Never heard of them. What? They're the new currency for the United Mammal Space Fleet. They're backed by mammals everywhere. Oh? Give me the willies. Give me the codes. They're on here, but I want all your willies. All of them? Why, that's outrageous. Well, if you're not interested. Wait, it's a deal. Ha <laughs> ha, been nice doing business with you. Same here. Wow, I did it. Wait till I tell Dead Eye. My way, you slimy bucket of toad gears! Make me, you feathered fool! <laughs> Talk! What is the strength of your fleet? Is there room service in this joint? I could use a tall glass of carrot juice. We'll see how cocky you are in the vacuum of space. Never tell. Ever. He will tell us nothing, but it no longer matters. We have reached the perimeter defense of Genus. I want the codes. I will have them soon. Not soon. Now! Put your hands up! Open those tubes or I'll zap you! 
A beetle juicy and berserker baboon! Stay back! Help! No. I am no longer an ordinary toad. No baboon can harm me. I am Toadborg! Okay, I warned you. Do you take me for some primitive void droid? Water cannot harm me. <laughs> Stay back, or I'll destroy the codes! So, El Negator failed. But I have something he did not have. Hostages. Give me the codes, or I will jettison your friends into space. Without space suits, they will perish in seconds. 60 seconds to tube jettison. 59. 58. 57. I don't... I don't... Destroy the codes! That's an order! It doesn't matter what happens to us. Save Genus. Ah, use your bamboo boots, matey! They'll stomp anything to bits! Give me the codes or they will be ejected. Bucky! Jenny! Didn't I? Do what's right, Willie! I, I won't let you down! <laughs> You miserable monkey! Would this help? I made a copy, of course. Alligator guarantees his deliveries. No! No! I made a copy, of course. Alligator guarantees his deliveries. No! Genus defense codes confirmed. And here are your Simoleons. <laughs> you tricked me, you lion sleaze. You will go out with the other trash. And now, I destroy Genus. Time for me to skidoo too. Invasions are such messy affairs. <laughs> Mother Elderberry. I beg permission to use my powers, or we're all doomed. Jenny, the Prime Directive of our sisterhood, says we must never let outsiders see the full extent of our powers. On the other hand, a third level psychic blast would probably go unnoticed. Thank you. What happened? I don't know. Any ideas, Jenny? I guess they just don't build control panels like they used to. Okay, let's go. We've still got to get out of here and warn Genus. <laughs> Let's corrupt out! But there are no codes in the mothership's computer! The codes remain in my database. I will transmit them myself. B but if anything happens to you, we'll be helpless. Then you'd better hope nothing happens to me. Now cease your cowardly prattle while I transmit the codes. It is done. Moving to genus orbit. Toadborg to mothership. Launching climate converter. Well done, Bruiser. Deadeye, park the croaker and get inside. Repair status? All systems at 70% of standard operation. Good work, Blinky. Engines full ahead. Go! There's nowhere to go. Great horn of toads, Bucky. Dog star? Seems to be a bit of a toad infestation, yeah. Look, in the southern ocean. Climate converter. He'll turn Genus into a toad infested swamp. Just what he did to my world. Dogstar, we've got to stop that thing. Why, yes, we'll do our best to keep these slimy bug eaters off your tail. Good hunting. Our 
lasers can't get through. We have to find a way to destroy it from the inside. There is no way in. Wait! Good. Pull up to it. I'm going in. What if it's a trap? I'm a sucker for traps. You're in command, first mate. Bucky, me boy, you're not going without old dead eye. Yeah, me too. You're all staying here, and that's an order. But Bucky, wait for me. Are you crazy? No, but you are. How can you turn it off without an engineer? I figured I'd play it by ear. I don't know how you escaped, Bucky O'Hare, but you will not leave here alive. You haven't learned. Nothing can harm me now. That does present a challenge. <laughs> oh, poor little toady. To think that Complex wasted all that power on a dumb little toad brain. Toads are real brave, picking on helpless planets. I am not a toad. I am toad born. Hey, toad Borg, where did Complex find you? Working in a fly pie factory? I was a worker. I was a storm toad. I was a warrior. Carry rodent. Willie! Why, the captain will have you hide from mutant, lad. Come on! I've created a negative field that will attract the lightning. The whole thing is gonna blow! No! This is not right! The lightning will destroy it! Oh, I got you! did it! We saved Genus! I think I'm going to have all my other metals melted down and make one big metal. Air Marshal, we've lost contact with Toadboard. The Genus satellites are turning on us. What a scare! <laughs> Complex will melt his metals? I think Complex will melt him. You should be out there, Willie. You're the real hero. I didn't do much. Besides, I gotta get home. Come back soon. Be the same without our engineer. And no sleezosaurs this time. <laughs> I'll make sure of that. Uh, say goodbye to Jenny. I, I guess she's busy. Willie, I was preparing this for you. An Aldebaran memory stone. Hurry back. You bet I will. Bye. <laughs> I'm telling you, for the last time, Al, I check the currencies from one end of the universe to another, and there ain't no such thing as a willy. That stuff is worthless. That pink-skinned baboon gave me worthless money? Me, a sneezosaur? <laughs> I didn't say you could laugh. I'll find that creature that gave me the willies in when I do. He'll pay very dearly indeed. This baby figures out everything. Speed, balance, helps you perfect some radical moves. Well, you've all done an excellent job. Certainly worth an A, but I see you had Willie helping you. That egghead? Heck no. I came up with this myself. 
I just kind of let him tag along for the kicks. Don't pay any attention to him, Willie. He's just... Willie? Hurry back. Another time and space, a parallel universe is falling on its face. When out of the chaos, who else could it be? But the animal adventurers from SPACE! Bucky! Captain Bucky O'Hare! Mutants and aliens and toads beware! You're looking for adventure? Well, this is it! With Jenny Dead Eye Blinky and Willie to win, I said, Bucky! Captain Bucky O'Hare! I'm now on the date on Bucky O'Hare on the Toad Wars! In the battle of the universe, you don't know what's next. You only know amphibians are made it complex! When you check out your scanner and the evil that it wants, there's only one course of action! Well, let's go for some toads! Bucky! Captain Bucky O'Hare! He goes where no ordinary rabbit would dare. If your righteous indignation has suffered a hit, and your photon accelerator is broken a bit, and you're losing your mind, and you're having a fear, get the funky fresh rabbit who can take care of it! To Bucky! Captain Bucky O'Hare! To say Bucky! I said Bucky! Bucky O'Hare! Let's croak us some toads! Hey, you made it to the end of the episode. That's awesome. If you like our videos, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. If you're in a position to help out the channel, consider supporting us on Patreon. Be sure to check out our Facebook page where you can keep up to date with us. And go ahead and watch another episode of your favorite nostalgic cartoons right here at the Cartoon Vault.